Yo, what's up, guys? Um, another quick video today. Um, outside, I just caught these two little guys. I'm gonna make a little enclosure for them. So, all I'm gonna do, really, I'm gonna use the container I just moved the mealworms out of. It's a pretty nice sized container for these little guys. Um, type of um, um, soil I'm using. I forget, man, I forgot what the name is called, and I just do the thing away. So, I'm just gonna. Make them a quick little cage. The freak is this? It's like a bunch of dirt, like stuck to. That's nasty. I don't know what that is. Uh, I'm just gonna spread that around. It's like a uh, like it comes in a brick, and like you gotta like water it down and let it soak. I had this sitting out for a while, so that's why it's kind of like dry. So, like, but like, I have to like soak it in water. Um, let's see what type of hides I have. Cause I'm quite sure these guys would love to have a couple of hides to hide in. I'll see what I have and I'll be right back. So these three are the best I can find for these, at least this enclosure. Uh, so what I'm gonna do with these, I guess I'm gonna just, uh, I'm gonna do this number right here. I'm gonna have like one somewhere like right here, say to the side a little bit. Kind of want to arch it because like i'm taking advantage of this broken part right there kind of want to arch it to make it look like a little cave i'm gonna take this one kind of want to tuck it under this one like so make that arch a little bit bigger so that's what we're looking at right now And now I want to take this piece and then just lay it across the top right there. And then like, have it like kind of like to the, hold on. Oh, that part just broke off. That's pretty good. And oh, I almost reached inside there and got one. Got one of them. And I, I want to dig out this part a little bit. Put that like right there. There we go. that down anyway so I guess I put this one like right here or something all right there that is right there Kind of tuck it around here. All right, there it goes. There that goes. Uh, this is the f water bowl. Because as you know, they're toads. They don't need a lot of water, but they still do need water. I mean, everything needs water, but like, still, you know what I'm saying? Every living thing, at least. This is their food dish. Um, as you guys probably know, toads. 
at least some can be very dumb and just like cannot hunt that well so just in case it's like is that case for these then I'll make sure to um, have a food dish uh, probably won't use it too much probably just use them put extra mealworms in there Right, let them get their own food, but that's probably the only time I'll probably do that. I will water it regularly. Oh, um, what else? Let's see. Water dish. Water dish. Um, got their water right here. The friendly middle water bottle. Airfleet put that in. I don't wanna drown it. There you go. Right there that goes. Now I'm just gonna release them into there. Well, I'm gonna shut that, close that up. Um, that's really it for this video. Just wanted to show you guys um, what I found and how I was gonna do their cage. That's, but that's really it. <sighs> I kind of don't want to put it over the hissing cockroaches because I'll have to move their cage each time I go to get something or move the hissing cockroaches. But I guess it's just going to have to do for now. But that's really it. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye oh, bye. Oh, and Roxy messed up her hammock again. She just does not like it being up. But. Oh, catch you guys next time. Hey guys, it's the next day. Um, I was recording a video last night about like these guys right here. And it was supposed to be a video, me just showing y'all what I had found and me making a cage for them. Um, they're two toads, but like the video had like, um, like, I don't know what happened to, like, the rest of the video. I got the first part of me basically, like, just introducing them and, like, showing what I was going to be putting inside the cage. But, like, the rest was just, like, gone. So, I'm just going to combine that video with this portion, like, with this video. Um, what we're going to be doing uh, is just going to be a feeding video. going to be... For Roxy, I'm gonna be cleaning her cage because she destroyed it once more. She just loved destroying her cage. I might just get Repti carpet for her instead of the paper towels because she just loves just messing right through that. Um, but for them, I'll just um, do a simple little um, theme for them and that'll be it. So I'm gonna get to Roxy first. I don't know why I like doing rocks but it's probably because like she's the, the most reach the easiest reach to, to reach. Wow, that stutter was crazy. Get all that out. Oops, just spilled it. <laughs> Take her out too. She loves messing up her hair. I put the hair right on my bed.
bollocks. to put the paper towels in there and I'll be back when that's done all right that's done now uh just gonna start putting this stuff back in there here I'll try doing what I said I was gonna do last time and actually move this part Put the food in their food bowl in there temporarily while I get their food ready. I'm gonna to take that out because I'm feeding them. is always pretty hard to put in so i'm gonna stop the recording to put it in all right i got that up now now i'm just gonna get roxy put her back in here now it's time for the food dishes food dishes dump that out Dude didn't eat too much of his food, so guessing he's gonna wanna eat quite a bit with me. Huh? Um, I give him the food today. I'm gonna get these chopped up and put them in bags and I'll be back when that's done all right I just got done uh, cutting them up I got two different bags the stems I give to the um, mealworms and the hitchin cockroaches and the kale, the kale itself um, I'm just gonna distribute this evenly real quick. Oh, hold on, I should have thought about this part. Opening the bag after I've sh shut it. Up.
Bugs. Now back up the stairs. Here. Zeus got his tail. She has hers. Let's take these guys out right here. Take both out at the same time. I'm only get, trying to get to one though. For now, I'll leave him out. Oh, how'd you get out? You, you guys climb up the sides. For them, they don't really need too many because there's not a lot right now. And for the rest of these, I'll just uh, put the rest inside of the more container. Right now for feeding for the toads, um, all I'm gonna do for them, I'm not just gonna try to interact with them too much. I'm just gonna put the food in the cage. Don't wanna stress them out too much. I'm gonna pick out a couple of good mealworms to put in the cage. Uh, like he found proper residence inside of the bowl. A little guy right here. He's right there just chilling.
I think that'll be it for right now. I did give them some last night just in case, like, I didn't know, like, how long they were out. So, that'll be fine for them right now. And I gave them quite a bit last night. But that's the part that the recording did not show. Which was absolutely beautiful. Um... Now for Tuck, has more well, square, but the middle, his last name is Tuck. Uh, I'm just gonna put a little bit of this stuff in there. Not gonna give him any um, treats today, because um, I did like last night, and I just wanna put those in moderation. If you're wondering what um, I mean by treats for a turtle, these right here. But here are just goodies right now, just going in and eat, eating pieces. You may say that I put too much in there, but he just like eats it throughout the day. So I don't gotta worry about that. But that's really it for this video. Here's basil right here. Just chilling out. Roxy's gonna get straight back to destroying her cage again. Cause she's not satisfied until she does. I'm just gonna, I think I'm just gonna get rep tea carpet for her. If she destroys this out, I'm just gonna get rep tea carpet for her. And um, we'll see what she does from there. But I'll see you guys next time. Um, thank you for watching. Peace out.